This seven-page progress report was released by the Council of Atlantic Ministers of Education and Training. It gives updates on their literacy projects and their goals for the future. We have a literacy action plan um, for the next three to four years. Um, and this was a first year report back on the progress that's been made on that plan. There's a number of initiatives uh, in that action plan in, in um, early childhood and in the public school system as well as the adult uh, side. One project that's actually just about finished, uh, we hired someone to develop standards and competencies for a, a document to, to, that describes the standards and competencies that teachers should have mm. to be good literacy teachers from beginning to uh, the secondary system. The Charlottetown Roll already has programs for students struggling to read and write. A resource teacher there says there just aren't enough teachers to help all the students who need it. We have a school of 1,100 students and, and on any given year we would receive coming in from the junior highs a list of students who um, have been identified with um, some sort of a learning challenge. You know, we have over 300 uh, students on our profile sheet, mm. and the number of us that there are in the building, it's, it's like my classes would be small, right? I mean, we don't take more than eight students in a resource mm. class at a time. So, you know, four eights, multiply that by two semesters, yeah. we're not even covering 100 students, right? So. Mm. Um, it's it's uh, more, more personnel to be able to, to help out with those students. Kalbeck says without more teachers and resources, students may struggle with this issue for the rest of their lives. So much of what you're going to have to do for the rest of your life mm. is going to require the skills of being able to read mm. and express yourself. I mean, y you, you become totally so much of life becomes not accessible for you in mm. the way of further education or certain types of jobs. But the Department of Education says the Literacy Action Plan focuses on improving things like curriculum rather than investing money in more teachers or technologies. Teachers say if the province really wants to tackle the problem, both areas need to be addressed. Leslie Keeping, reporting for The Surveyor.